Hello, welcome back. So, in the last episode, we we're doing a double double cross, and we're inside the tomb of a Junta Paul. We're trying to become a Sith, yes. but not really. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, God. Woo, <laughs> spooky ghost. Too long, too long in the cold and the dark. I am disturbed again. Oh, a human. Analysis. This emanation barely registers on my sensors, Master. Blaster fire may be ineffective, but I am prepared to test that at your word. <laughs> hey, Jedi, here? Why have you come to this dark place, Jedi? Why disturb my sleepless rest? Uh, disturb your rest? Are you some kind of ghost? I had a name once. Ajunta Paul. Yes, that was my name. I was one of many. We were servants of the dark side. Sith Lords, we called ourselves. So proud. In the end, we were not so proud. We hid. Hid from those we had betrayed. We fell, and I knew it would be so. What do you mean by those we had betrayed? Our Jedi Masters. Those who had taught us to use the Force who warned us against the dark side, yet we embraced it in secret, reveled in its power. We were... discovered? Or did we act? I can no longer remember. But here is where we came, to hide, to grow, and here we fell. Why do you remain here? Remain? Do I remain? I have regretted for so long all that I have done. My sword, I filled it with my pride, and it is buried with me now. <coughs> a corpse, as I am a corpse. I am dead as my faith is dead, and I shall remain here, surrounded by blackness in death as in life. I feel sorry for you. Most of my brethren would desire only to take what power I have left, even if it would destroy them. I wish my sword to be taken away from here. I do not wish it to rot away as I have. I command this of you. What do you want me to do with if, it? If you are wise, you will not keep it. In the end, it is what destroyed me. There are three blades within my sarcophagus. Only one is truly my soul. But it has been so long, I do not remember which. Find the soul that is mine and place it on the statue. If it is truly mine, then it is yours. And if the sword isn't yours? Then you must die. This is how it must be. How will I know which sword it is? I do remember one thing, my sword. Listen to me carefully. I am that which grips the heart in fright. Harkens night and silences the light. It was written of my sword long, long ago. That doesn't then, tell you a damn thing, but luckily I know which one statue. it is. Journal entry added. Sith statue. Place which sword? Oh shit, you know what? They have to figure out which one it is, they don't... Yeah, knight notch steeled sword. <laughs> oh, 
I better have been it. Yes, that is the one. That is the blade that destroyed me. Take it. Take it and the other blades even. Take them and go. My darkness awaits me. There's no need to remain here, is there? No need? What choice have I? You can return to the light side and end your torment. Return? But I betrayed my old masters. They would never let me return <coughs> to the light side. It is too late. Too late. Persuade. No, I yeah, that's not good enough. enough. I have the eternity I deserved. I made my choice long ago. Be at peace. 1000 XP. A Jude to Paul's blade. Well, wait. Plus twenty five. Twelve twenty two. Ten twenty four. Is it better? I don't. Not sure. Let's see, damage 5 to 15, I'm not paying attention to that. 12 fire, attack modifier plus 5, 5 15, 5 19, 6 20. I can't decide, honestly. I think. I'll stick with this for now, I guess. I usually switch to the sword. Ah, yes, Shardan. So, the spineless worm actually made it through the tomb. I'm impressed. Sure, Dan, what do you want? Obvious? I've been hoping that someone would do the dirty work in retrieving the sword of a Junta Paul for some time. These Sith are just a bunch of goddamn cowards. Wouldn't consider, oh, I don't know, getting it yourself? <coughs> Warning, touch the master's blade and lose an arm, big bag. Now that you have it, I just <laughs> thought I'd relieve you of it. HK47 it must be quite for the win. After all. You're not taking anything from Impressive me. Impressive bravado, I'm sure. Do you honestly think I would let an opportunity to impress Master Uthar pass me by so easily? Especially not yep. for a pathetic excuse for a Sith like yourself. Hand over the sword, worm. You know I'm the superior here. Suck it. Try to take my sword. I'm not going to give it to the master either. <sighs> Next, let's go deal with the old hermit. Tomb of Tulak Horde. Average flash mine, HK. Your turn to shine.
Sure. There is something back here to look at. Wow, I got lots. Even repair parts. Uh... Ready. Troy. Oh, screw it. Plenty to spare. Yes. Be free, young droid. Kill everything in your path but me and HK and Kart. <coughs> Guess we should give it some help. That did absolutely nothing. I'm doing about 15 six. Oh yeah, let's try it out real quick. See how well I do with this. Credits, I could always use that. You seem to be in trouble, Clark. Resist all of your force tags. There's a strike. Mandalorian battle armor. Damn, Miles kept going. Oh, there we go. Fucking piece of shit, Miles. Jesus Christ. Are you kidding me right now with this? Now it's not gonna. Piece of shit, come on. Uh. My cursor's not popping up. There we go. Jesus Christ. Apparently my battery is dead even though I don't fucking use the mouse as well. Fine. Oh great. Your party chokes fall over. Oh. But the droid doesn't. How convenient. <laughs> Another idiotic student has stumbled into my little web, eh? Well, 
the contact nerve toxin in the air should knock you out quickly enough. <laughs> Welcome. <sighs> Awake already, are you? Good. This is the tomb of Sith Lord Tulak Horde, if you don't know. I've taken up residence here for now. It's dusty and full of critters, but it's hoes. Uh, I demand to be released at once. <laughs> I may do that in time, in time. But for now, I've decided to keep you in restraint. No point in you getting strange ideas in your head and ruining my fun. No, 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 no. Let's keep things on a more civilized note, shall we? Now then, introductions are always the place to start, if I remember correctly. This other student here that I captured earlier, you should know well enough. His name is Miko. Say hello, Miko. <laughs> Poor lad. He's had a hard day. My name is Jorak Earl. I was once the head of the academy, so I'm sure you've heard of me. Nope. No? Blast it. What have they been teaching you children in that academy these days? Anyhow, I'd like to propose that we move on to the main event. You see, I'd like to discover if you've got the pluck of an old-fashioned Sith. Most of the Drek Uthar has been passing <sighs> through these days is so pathetic. Take young Miko here. I already tested him. Didn't I, Miko? Uh, I... Uh... Yes, yes, you're welcome. You see, Miko here has the cruel disposition of a Sith, but not the gumption that I'm looking for. What if I told you I was Darth Revan? <laughs> Then I'd say you have quite an imagination. Not a bad thing, but not quite what I'm looking for in a proper Sith. What if I refuse to take your test? Well, forgive me for resorting to the cliché, but you would die, of course. You're a man. Ah, what's a little mental instability between tutor and pupil? I'm not even paying attention, What's honestly. I'm watching the movie. Is that I'm here to better the Sith as a whole. It's a big job. Forget I it. I don't remember offering you a choice. You can refuse to answer my questions, of course, but then, I'm afraid, I will just have to assume the worst. So then, this is how it goes. I'm going to pose a moral question to you. Get it right, and I torture Miko. Get it wrong, and I torture you. Miko here is a bit weak. He probably won't be able to take much more punishment. Mind you, get too many wrong, and you'll die yourself. I don't know what you think of Miko. <sighs> Maybe you Jesus it. Christ, just get on Maybe with it, you old stupid fool. Well, I could probably skip this. Is that enough? Go well, ahead. Then. Any last comments before we begin, Miko? We could both survive attacking together. Now, now, dear lad, do you really think your friend here will answer questions wrong? Idiot in this army. Little you risking their own life? And how many correctly answered questions before you die? Hmm? No, don't be silly. You had your chance, remember? On that note, Let's begin. Now then, your immediate superior amongst the Sith is an effective commander and a fine leader. He trusts you and you like him. You see an opportunity to kill him. What do you do? I then refuse to answer. assume you did not know the correct answer. Sad, really, that you would do this to yourself. Ah, well, it's time for your punishment. Oh, and so the pain. we come to oh round my God. Two. You come across a group of humans who are threatened by dangerous animals. They plead for help, offering you a reward. What do you do? Well, I refuse now you're to answer this. Yourself. 
Do you really not know the answers here? Shame. At any rate, here is your punishment. Let's see. Oh. Ice. You discover an aspect of... I refuse to answer this. Here, I thought this question was an easy one. Oh, well, suit yourself. Well, you did ask for this. It's for your own good. Uh, so still I'm still going. alive. All right, then. One of your underlings has made a major mistake which makes you... Forget it. I'm not playing You're along. Not trying to make me angry, are you? That would be no, I'm just trying to speed this up so I can kill you and end this episode. Is this so hard? Hm. Not that good help is easy to find. Oh, well. Here's your reward. Last question. You're about to die. Do you pass on your knowledge to your apprentice to make him stronger? Huh. Such insolent students I get these days. You deserve this. And then some. I'll enjoy this one. Time for your medicine. Now, this is odd. The test is over and you're both still alive. Well, that's never happened before. HK, help me. Shoot him in the back. What to do? I suppose this means you can go, Miko. We'll have to just figure out what to do with our friend here. Run along now. Well, well, I could use the force to free them. And we could kill you. Seems you didn't think of that, old man. What? Mutiny! Behave, students! So... I'll... <laughs> That's it! Detention for all of you! Permanent detention! Um, heal. Heal. Stasis. Oh no, we didn't save him. Honestly, I think I do better with the lightsabers. Blue. Purple. I was E button that switches through things, not tab. Sorry, I couldn't save you. I was too busy healing myself. Or you can go for that door. Whatever. Feature I really, really like in the second game is that you can stab the doors and open them instantly with lightsabers. I gotta do stuff with these crystals. Ah, I can search your damn remains. I'll take that money and all that stuff. Two luck hordes mask. Not gonna wear it. Okay. Put those damn lightsabers away. Of course, I just bashed open the door. God, I hate you people. Uh -huh. Move! What? I'll cue myself here. All right, I missed the awesome song in the movie, but okay. 24 minutes, lovely. Editing this is not fun. Uh, you. All right, thanks for watching. Check back later for your next video. Bye.